Welcome to Itsrafik. In today's video, we are going to discuss about half yearly syllabus of computer science. Seba have already given the syllabus in calendar, academic calendar. So we'll discuss it from the calendar only. This is the syllabus for class 10. And now we'll move to the computer subject, computer science elective. So this is the first column is for half yearly. Oh, sorry. The first column is for first unit. In first unit, there are two chapters. They are introduction to network, chapter one, and chapter four, introduction to loop. And for half yearly, you can see here it's given half yearly exam, and here it is written. courses allotted from April to September. So in calendar whatever chapters are given from April to September all the chapters will required for half yearly examination. Now let's go through the calendar. This is the April month and the right hand side column is for class 10 and here you can see chapter 1 April month chapter 1 the introduction to computer network and next come May month in May month it is computer science chapter 4 introduction to loop after that June month chapter 5 nested loop in C after that July is summer vacation there will be no class so August August month chapter 6 array in C after that September September month we have again half yearly exam also from 21 September as you can see here on the calendar from 21 September to 27 September it is half yearly examination on September month chapter 7 functions in C Man, means you will record chapter 1 4 5 6 and 7 till functions in C you will record for half yearly examination so you don't require to prepare for chapter 8 which is pointers in C till functions in C you will prepare for examination again I am writing the chapter number here you will record chapter one then four five six and seven chapter one is computer network and I think computer network this one introduction to computer network chapter 4 introduction to loop chapter 5 nested loop in C chapter 6 arrays in C and chapter 7 functions in C so these five chapters are required for half yearly examination I have already completed explaining these chapters so you can go through the videos and you can clear your doubt and if you need some extra questions for half yearly examination or if you need any sample papers you can write in comment section definitely i will try to make some sample papers so only this much for today you will record chapter 1 4 5 6 7 for half yearly examination thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye